What's good, y'all, man? It is your boy, Sniper Kicks, and today is Jordan 1 Vault Day. You already know I'm going out to pick up, you know, a good amount of pairs. I hit on a lot of gray school, took some L's on men's sizes, but today's gonna be a good day. I'm running around, got my, you know, everything planned accordingly because, you know, I can't waste any time. I got other obligations for today, so it's gonna be in out each store. Um, but it should be fun today, man. And, you know, I got this new camera, a professional camera, so, you know, the the footage is gonna be better. The, the um, the picture is going to be better. So, um, Vaults took a W on sneakers. I took an L, took an L, finally took a W. You know, I kept going even when I was taking L's, got a size nine and a half. Uh, but other than that, took L's on everything else, you know, online. So, I'm about to pick up from the flex. I won around 25, 30 pairs. A lot of them are gray school. So, I run around like 28 ish. Uh, so, I might hold some, I might sell them all now, but. Um, I'm gonna get this thing rolling, head into Fox Valley Mall, the first mall I'm going to, and let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Woo! So, that was a good, you know, little cook. Got the bag right here. Um, so we're gonna just keep the thing going. We'll just keep it going. Uh, leaving Fox Valley, as you can see that, and then we're gonna, I gotta head back home, I forgot something. But uh, other than that, you know, Today's gonna be a good day for these. I gotta be in and out, in and out, and keep it moving. All right, y'all, man. What do you guys think about these vaults? Um, just left um, Fox Valley, picked up a picked up a size. First time me seeing these in hand, and I'm kind of, mm, they're okay. But on the comments below, tell me, do you really like these vaults? I mean, they're they're straight. I might grab me a personal pair, but. They a little bit, uh, let's, let's look at them real quick. Let's look at them. So we're in the car. I just want to look at them real quick. Let's take a look. Uh -huh. They're okay. I did see with those vault laces, these are these are better with the vault laces but they they straight it was funny because i was talking to one of the um Foot locker employees and they's like this is a mid colorway <laughs> they said this is a mid colorway but you know they straight to me though they straight so now at um yorktown mall and trying to trying to see you know if this finish line has you know leftover pairs because you never know sometimes finish lines you know their computer or their algorithm doesn't give all the pairs out to people that enter the raffle so you know I'm gonna go in there see if they got extra pairs I got a pair here at champs and we'll see how that goes so I'm trying to get in and out like I said earlier because uh, I got things to do today but should be fun and uh, let's see let's see what they got all right, also guys man I'm gonna give y'all a breakdown exactly how much I made on this shoe um, because I want to you know show you guys you know I've been getting a lot of requests to be like hey can you break down what you make whatever on a release so you know that's what I'm gonna do once I get home I'm gonna go through my spreadsheets all that good stuff and show y'all exactly what I you know make with a release like this um, so I'll put that I'll put that on for you guys. I did the other video on the Jordan 5 um what those called again Bel Airs. And I showed y'all how much I made on that, but I'm gonna do another one for y'all today. Um because at the end of the day, you know, I wanna you know show people that it's possible to resell for a living and make a great living, you know, doing it as well. So um it just takes a little bit of determination, a little bit of um, you know hard work you know up front but once that's done and you have that vision it's all possible man it's all possible so i'm about to you know pick up these pairs and then head to the next mall but i'm gonna do that for y'all guys you know show exactly you know what i how much i make and everything on these shoe and you already know the vlogs and the process of me picking them up flex accounts and everything but i want to do that breakdown for y'all as well all right y'all so secured there's one pair right there. 
um, going to finish line, seeing if they do have a couple extra. Um, so um, we'll see where that is. If not, I gotta go to North Riverside, um, pick up, you know, I got a good amount of pairs there. Then head into Woodfield. So it should be, it's gonna be a quick day today. It's gonna be a quick day, I mapped it all out. Um, so it's gonna be a quick day and then the rest I'll pick up tomorrow. Remember, you got two days to pick up with the Flex app, two days. All right, y'all, so dead mission at finish line, all of them was reserved, um, or lady was capping, either or. Is you know, sometimes employees, depending on who you are, depending, you know, if they think you're a reseller or whatever, they might not even tell you the truth. So, it is what it is, but I'm heading over to North Riverside and um, picking up, you know, a good amount of pairs there because they have a whole bunch of stores but it should be you know not too long um, so I'm about to head there now um, and pick up the rest not the rest of the pairs but a lot of pairs there and then go to Woodfield so let's get it let's get it let's get it what's good y'all man just got to North Riverside Mall um, I don't know if y'all can see that but um, yeah North Riverside Mall about to pick up some pairs man this is one of you know the mall in illinois i guess you know most of most of the pairs so they have so many stores here they literally have four foot lockers a foot action champs kids foot locker so it's gonna be a, you know and i want out each and every one of these stores so i'm about to pick up a good amount um at this um at this mall right here um so it should be should be decent Definitely should be decent. So, all right, y'all. So, um, let's see, I got a couple with me. Um, but yeah, you know, I picked up from two foot lockers, heading to the next one right now. Um, so it should be, you know, pretty smooth. There's not a lot of people at the mall today, as you can see. There's not that many people, you know, here today. So, man, December was crazy, man. People were shopping and everything, but. Today is not too bad, so I'm gonna get in and out and head to uh, Woodfield Mall after this. All right, y'all, that is a wrap for North Riverside. Try to show you all the pairs that I picked up. It's around like six, um, so pretty good. You know, not too bad, not too, not too bad. So uh, about to head to Woodfield Mall. I'm going right on pace. The malls are not, the malls not flooded, so you know I get to go in and out in spots, but. Let's head to so um, done with North Riverside. Um, you can probably see I got some bags back here, um, bags back here, um, bags right here as well. Um, so heading to Woodfield Mall next. Um, it's been a pretty smooth day. One thing that I appreciate is that the malls are not flooded. <laughs> not flooded anymore uh, holiday season it was nuts it was crazy there's so many people but you know now it's you know just people that's trying to shop you know really um so heading to woodfield mall uh it's been pretty you know decent um these vaults people like them it's like half and half some people like them some people don't some people are complaining about you know that tab um that's vault you know some people like it some people don't um comment below if you like these vaults if you got a personal pair you know how you feel about them um but now heading to woodfield mall uh gonna pick up you know they they're 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 not they're similar to north riverside they have a lot of stores they don't have as many foot lockers north riverside has four foot lockers woodfield has one um and a kids foot locker they have the foot action champs so about to pick up pairs there and then just after that head to the crib and um that's gonna be today and then you know like flex said, you get two days so you know pick up um from pick up some more pairs tomorrow as well so all right y'all man heading to woodfield mall so all right y'all cooked up at um woodfield i made a mistake man so when i was at fox valley there was a pair that i didn't pick up at that champs so that's why you have to stay organized when you pick up all these pairs because now i don't know if i can get it today maybe tomorrow so organization is such a big thing I'll show you guys my, like, I, I make a list, but I did a little mistake, thought it was gonna be at Woodfield, and it's actually Fox Valley, so. I'm uh, heading home now. I'm trying to see if I can go back to Fox Valley, pick up this pair, but it happens, so. 
heading out. Got the shoes and keep it moving. You know, today was a quick day. Um, I usually take the whole day to pick up pairs, but I got something to do today. Uh, so heading home now. All right, y'all, man. Um, let me take this mask off. I'm back in the car. And like I said, I made a mistake. I thought I had a, you know, I thought I had a pair here at Woodfield, but actually had one at Fox Valley. So I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time to go there. So hopefully tomorrow I can get them. Um, but you know, you gotta be organized. I usually have my list here. I don't know if you can see that. Of like the places I gotta go. I usually have the list here. Um, but it is what it is now. So um, heading home now. But I just want to say one thing real quick. A lot of a lot of places did not get their shipment on these Jordan One vaults. So a lot of them. I talked to a couple. You know the managers at the Foot Lockers. And they said they'll get them next week sometime. So yeah. So if you wanted these, don't panic. They're coming to you know coming to Foot Lockers. But the only thing is first come first serve. You got no word and everything. There's resale on these, so reseller is gonna go shoot up there. Uh, but. Um, if you really want them, you know, try to find word when these late ship. There's so many late shipments. I hit on so many grade school, but I took L's on a lot of men's. And usually when I don't get waitlisted and just take a straight L, the, the store didn't get their pairs or I picked the size that they didn't get. Um, so it is what it is, but you can still cop. I still, you know, got more to pick up. I hit around 30 pairs. Like I said, around like 28, you know, 30 range. Um, selling them, you know, selling them for a decent price. Uh, we'll go through the numbers when I get home um, and show you how much I make during the shoot because a lot of my subscribers want to know Hey sniper kids, how much you make on a release like this? So um, Let's uh, get it going. I'm about to hit home and you know, we'll go over those numbers and everything. All right, y'all What's good y'all? It is your boy sniper kicks day two um, Heading to Fox Valley like I said yesterday. I forgot to shoot at champs at Fox Valley But you know I'm about to meet up with my man got him carts if you follow my channel, uh, you know that's my guy. He bots, you know, his service are A1, got him carts. I'm about to meet up with him. Uh, so uh, we about to go to finish line, get these leftover pairs at finish line. And then I'm got to go to that champs that I forgot my pair. And then we got to run. It's probably be an all day thing, but uh, it's definitely going to be dope, man. You about to see, you know, got him carts real quick. And, and we, 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 we about to, you know, chop it up for a second. And so I y'all, man, at Fox Valley Mall. Um, about to try to get these uh, vaults, you know. Fox Valley does leftovers. Some of them doing the next day. Some of them doing at 5 p.m. So you got to just figure it out yourself at your at your store. Um, but that's a good time if you don't, you know, end up winning the raffle. You can still get a pair, just like the Flex app. The finish line is that same day at five, or the next day that morning. So. I know there's a line, so we'll see what this line is looking like. I know my man, you know, Dre, he's already in the line, so we shall see how it goes. And I got my boy, special guest, got him carts. What up, what up, what up? Man, as you, all you guys that have been following me, man, you already know about this guy right here. Uh, doing it like nobody else. Uh, we over here finished like trying to pick up some of these vaults, but y'all sleep on them vaults, man. Y'all was <laughs> sleep on them vaults. I'm telling you. Yeah, so it's it's crazy because it's like everybody was sleeping on them, and now look at the line. It swings all the way. Everybody want these now. They will sleep on them. But yeah, as you know, man, my guy guy got them carts. If you're new, if it's your first time seeing this video, he does slots. He hits for a whole bunch of people. Help my sister, my, myself, her boyfriend, a whole bunch of people hit on a whole bunch of pairs. So yeah, my man got them carts right here. Doing it like no other. So I right, y'all, as promised, taking a look at these numbers. Um, as you see, I got a whole bunch of pairs. And I know you're wondering why the buying price is 170 flat and 130 flat. So um, I have a tax exempt, so I do not pay tax on these shoes. Um, so that's why it's a flat number right there. Here's the purchasing price of all the shoes. Um, 233, um, 258, 239. As you see, let's go down and let's see exactly how much did I make. So I only sold nine shoes so far because I didn't you know, sell them at the price that I want. So I made $854.27 off nine shoes. So I have a whole bunch of these still needed to be sold. 
Um, so.